Hi. Hi, folks. You know, in some countries, they have what's known as a constitutional monarchy. Basically, they have a monarch, a king, a queen, an emperor. That's a figurehead as the head of state where all the legislative action, the laws that are being passed, takes place in an elected body, uh, be it a parliament or a congress or something to that effect. Well, here in the United States, yeah, we have a Congress, and guess what? We also have a monarch. Yeah, it's called the imperial presidency of the regime leader, President Barack Obama, Democrat. That's what he is, kids. The imperial presidency, and he's being protected by the news media. Here's what happens. The DREAM Act went before the Congress. It has to do with illegal... Uh, illegal immigrants into the country. It doesn't pass. Well, the president passes it on his own through executive decree. That's right. What the Congress failed to pass, the imperial president passed. No problem. Now let's listen to what the Congress had to say about that. Gee! <laughs> so now that the imperial president got away with that, he once again made a decree. And this time it has to do with welfare reform. The Welfare Reform Act was passed, I think, in 1996 by a Republican Congress and signed by a Democrat president, President X-rated Clinton. While he was soiling the White House, he also happened to sign this legislation. And part of it was people on welfare had to demonstrate a desire to work or look for work. Well, the imperial president, President Barack Obama, Democrat, he just took that out of the legislation. No more of that work clause he just threw out. Yeah, he can do that, be the imperial president. That's it, kids. Now let's listen to what the Congress had to say. See? <laughs> so in the constitutional monarchy, you have a monarch, a head of state, that's a figurehead, while the legislative authority takes place and the legislature. Now here in the United States, we have a people's government. A government by the people and for the people that perished from this earth. That's what we have. We have elected representatives that are figureheads. Constitutional. We have a constitutional figurehead in our Congress while we have an imperial presidency in the White House. That of that Democrat, President Barack Obama. See, that was a civics lesson, kid. Hi, we'll see you. God bless you. God bless America that used to be. And God bless the nation you have to live in. See ya. <laughs>